welcome to my channel if you're a returning subscriber welcome back and if you're a new subscriber hi my name is manel underscore v guys i am off to a staycation with my husband oh my hair guys this is why i'm very serious about my week journey because i need to give my hair break honestly every five minutes the urge to relax it creeps up and honestly i understand why i think trying out new relaxers is not a good idea for me i need to stick to the relaxer that i usually use but anyway um hope you guys are good my husband and i are going to these instagrammable log cabins outside of cape town uh my husband's birthday is right after my birthday so he came back for his birthday we are going to be having the time of our lives today T today tomorrow uh for two nights we've, got, we've gone for two nights and that's what we're doing i started i'm starting this vlog like oh actually before we go there we're gonna go to cape town to go do some birthday shopping guys what's going on with my hair i need to buy my birthday gift i was waiting for him because <laughs> i was waiting for my husband we're going to buy my birthday gift and his birthday gift because uh y'all are striking these taxis are striking and i was scared to go to go anywhere to cape town because i was just like these people are attacking normal citizens not only taxis so i don't want to be part of that so i was just like you know what no let me stay at home my husband will understand and rather safe than sorry honestly so we're gonna go to cape town do some shopping my hair looks horrendous though do some shopping and after shopping we're gonna head to the cabins we're probably gonna be doing a but it doesn't matter because happiness comes first <laughs> anyway let me show you what i'm wearing today's outfit is very very boring i am wearing my mahindras what am i without these jeans my belt a linen top and this poetry sweater there really isn't much to it honestly yeah i'm bored in myself but i i'm too lazy to think hard but this is how i'm looking today and yeah let's go to our train just decided that we should take my level four for repairs because i don't know if you can see here My kids cut this thing off. So I think we can repair it. So we're gonna return that. These will just be in the car. I have my pochette motif. Guys, cry with me. I'm so bored. guys we've arrived at the cabins it's quite late like we left cape town late it's like 10 so i can't really show you much honestly i think i'll show you tomorrow but this place getting here guys getting here getting here 
Um, if you're gonna come here, I suggest that you have a big call actually because wow. Oh no. Oh no. It's not bad though, but like I think maybe because it's night and I'm just a very nervous person. My husband is not. Yeah, I was just like freaked out, but it's beautiful. Uh, I'll show you everything tomorrow. Let me just pack the groceries. I think we bought too much groceries. Um, I'm just gonna pack the groceries and then maybe wash my face, sleep, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I also feel like flu is coming at a very fast pace and I need to solve that. The purchases I made today! Oh my god. Guys. I'm excited. I'm so excited. Like, I am so excited. Um, yeah, we'll talk about them when I get home. Because let's enjoy Mr. V's birthday. <laughs> guys oh my god i look like a hobo um my husband and i are up this early because then we're going to forage cell service wi-fi we need to get wi-fi to check on our kids before we even start our day You guys are gonna be so mad at me when I tell you I just woke up. Um, <laughs> this morning was so promising, and I thought that I was gonna have the time of my life. My husband even left, he went to the little town that they have here. Sana, so I flew said. One thing about the way my life is set up, actually, I have to go through it before I have fun. And if I'm having too much fun, my flu, really, my throat was hurting so much, still hurting, still is hurting. Uh, it's hurting a lot. I don't know why my eyes look like this, but it's hurting a lot and I'm just like exhausted. But at the end of the day, guys, I also came here to relax um my husband and i just came up with the idea to make poiki course because we did we the intention was to make poiki course guys but uh also it's like getting late but you know what i'm gonna do it because to so my husband but i also want him to put ribs on the braai because he did set up the fire before he left he's going to get me vaseline I want to put ribs on the bride before because I'm starving. Uh, we bought like pastries from Paul's. Um, but like, I don't want pastries, guys, give it the papa. And you know what? Let me start cutting up the vegetables for the poiki. And then we can. My hair's also a mess. We can start. I want you guys to see how ready it is. So gorgiana, like ugh, I feel like my camera is even not doing justice. Like it's so pretty. But we also have this like thing where you can lie down. I'm gonna I'm gonna hang out here tomorrow morning before we leave. It's it's stunning. It's so pretty. There are other cabins like around. Oh there, there's the other one. Can you see? But these places are stunning. We have a little jacuzzi here. And this is like the little patio. Basically, this is a container, guys, turned into a little campsite cabin. So cute.
I'm gonna have this because I'm so hungry. Guys, I don't know why I look so different today. Maybe because I had a full night's sleep. Oh, my hair's looking dodgy. Kipokatia, guys. Kipokatia, because I need my problems to be solved. I am drinking. Um, I'm just trying to check. Lemon peel and ginger root tea from Woolies. I hope it fixed my problems, guys, because I'm... Me and my husband are even thinking of uh, booking another place and getting the kids because there's a taxi strike, guys. And no one is sending their kids anywhere. I don't know what's in this thing, but it's nice. So good. I can't believe I haven't been on my phone in so long. I actually don't need my phone, guys. I actually don't need my phone. You know, I used to be like off social media for months. And I'll be okay. But I mean, like now I understand I have, I have to interact with you guys, and I enjoy it. I really love it. But like, if you really want to break and like off social media, you kind of want to be like full on off grid. These cabins are like the cutest things to do. Mm. I literally can't get Wi-Fi anywhere. Like. There isn't even a spot where we can get Wi-Fi. We literally have to drive out to get Wi-Fi. Let me go check on my pub, because one thing about me, I want pub. I get so friendless when you come. <laughs> my husband is so excited. Let me show you. Oh my god, my shadows. Can't wait, get some. Hope it's nice. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm done washing and we're about to check out. I'm so sorry that I'm not a good vlogger. But anyway, let me show you what I'm wearing. Uh, I'm giving you a little wood cabin chic. <laughs> Wait. My husband also looks nice. But I'm wearing this turtleneck from Shein. This from Poetry. Coach belt from my friend Bali. White pants from H&M. And my Zara boots. Slay! <laughs> <laughs> morning my friends uh good morning from me and my crusty wig <laughs> i hope you guys are doing well i'm trying to take off this wig because i am experiencing a lot of rippling here and with the extensive oh my god doll anyway guys sorry about that um 
I saying? I don't even remember. But basically, I just have to take off this wig and cut off this lace and just try working around installing this wig because I really want to start being that person who sleeps with the wig because I just don't have the time. Like, also, I kind of stopped going to the gym since the kids have been off school. So, they're even back now. Like, since the holidays. I've kind of been off the gym. I went there, but like, I didn't even go enough times. So, also, I feel like I don't know why. I'm just like, I don't want to gym anymore. I don't want to like, gym gym. Even though it makes me feel so good. I think I'm just going to take a break until Monday. And then just feel, but I want to start walking in the afternoon and in the morning on on from monday and i'm also going to fast to see if that will be a different they, if there will be a difference because i feel like i've been going to the gym yes i feel good and i love that about gym but like i'm not getting any results and it's annoying me but anyway my husband is still here good shot good shot because i want to go get the lights that i ordered for this thing and i also want to get the paint uh, he's going to have to DIY that for me quickly. Uh, it's not going to be a quick job, but that's what we're going to do. <laughs> anyway, I have so many things to unbox. Guys, you guys are going to have to ignore my crusty wig. Let me maybe try comb it. Just to be decent. I have so many fun things to unbox. Um... I'm so scared. Like, guys, honestly, my anxiety is not allowing me to unbox the, those other things. But I have something to unbox, guys. I bought a computer, as I told you, because I thought in my head, getting a laptop is going to be able to replace my sister. Because uh, I'm, I'm honestly not ready to get a PA ready. And someone that I don't know in my space, in my house, in my life, I'm just, I'm not ready. I really am not. It doesn't matter how many NDAs I'll make you sign. I'm just not ready. So right now, uh, me and my sister are going to try to see what we can do. But I feel like getting a laptop was one of them because one of the, what you call it, a step forward. Because I feel like only being dependent on a desktop is a bit like... It doesn't make sense, even though we don't get low shading anymore. But I feel like sometimes I want to go to a coffee shop and work outside of the house. Maybe I'm somewhere. Maybe I'm traveling. Because now my husband, I used to use my husband's laptop, but I can't do that because I get cool. Does that make sense? So I got a, come, not a computer, a laptop. My child will literally scream at me for saying it's a computer. Also, my skin is getting better. I'll show you what I what i got for my skin i don't know if i showed you i don't even remember but also oh my god that place we went to scrum deliam guys oh my god you know what if you're tired of like the city or just like spitty pity or you know constantly answering your phone getting your emails checking social media if you want to break from all of that go to these cabins with no wi-fi like Me and my husband reconnected. We even made decisions that like we've been running away from making in such a long time. Like not running away really, but like kind of like putting in the back burner. And we connect. Oh, guys, it was so nice. If we were literally like we wanted to stay there longer, but like we couldn't because these places are so fully booked, and we couldn't even find one that had a opening for the day after, which was yesterday, because um. Sana. oh my god ah, if i could i would go back and next time if i book those cabins i'm going there for for a week like i feel like a few days is not enough but anyway let's open this computer guys i don't know why i always call a laptop a computer and it really just messes up with my kids like MacBook Pro, I 
think 13 inch in not one terabyte what is it I don't know the space but yeah and I don't know if you guys care it's M2 guys and that's it or computer but it's the M2 10 something you guys know what I'm talking about but it doesn't really matter but it's so pretty oh my god guys literally so I don't know if you guys know but I was using the MacBook Air for a while before I got my desktop before it died because guys honestly the MacBook Air is a waste of time <laughs> If you're gonna go and buy an i laptop or an, an apple Mac laptop don't get the air unless if like you do tiktoks and you edit like really small short clips because editing youtubes on an, a macbook air honestly like so bad but this is an upgrade um i've always craved this thing i don't know only Lena, but like oh this digital i don't know what you call this but this thing <laughs> i always craved it let me show you actually i'm so happy that this computer was delivered when my husband was here because i need him to be able to set up the things because i never know how to set up anything wasa what do you call it what do you call it my editing applications i don't know he knows everything and he will do everything for me uh and i'm just so happy i had this big take a lot order i don't know if i was able to form it but i purchased quite a few things and one of the things that i bought because i know that my laptop is on the way was a cover or a case because i'm old now i care about my laptop being covered <laughs> You know, back in the days, like, I didn't care. But why does it seem so big? This is huge. Why? Oh, I'm so mad. Guys, take a lot is dizzy, hey? One thing about take a lot, but... Guys, there's literally no food at Woolies. Like a corn dog, guys. Go empty. Guys, I quickly went to Willie's to go get chicken because my husband wanted to... He wants chicken. When I tell you that the fridges are empty, you will be shocked. Like, there's literally nothing at Willie's. But anyway, my wig is off now. I want to quickly style it. And I think I will put it on maybe tomorrow. Not today. Uh, because, like, what is the point? Do <laughs> Lala. Anyway, maybe I'll do my bald cap before I sleep. But I got this from Take A Lot, guys. I got this. This was recommended by Molly Beauty, my friend. Uh, when I tell you that this is the best purchase I've made from Take A Lot, if, I'm, if you ask me what's the one thing that you want to go, I should buy from Take A Lot, it's this stand. This wig stand, oh my God. Also, just like this wig head. If sis is finished she is finished i can't even stick pins on this head anymore because uh they literally come off so i i always have to replace this after two months so this was a very very good investment but anyway before i go make habibi food because i'm back on kitchen duty my husband is here I wanted to show you some stuff that I bought, but I think I'll show you tomorrow. A little clothing haul, because you guys know that a girl's trying to make it in the fashion content business, see? And, I mean, not that make it, but like, you know, I'm just trying to be serious about it. Because I feel like I sort of kind of cracked the code for, uh, for, for my other um not industries but niches that i i have and i feel like the fashion one is the one where i'm just like i want to do more of it but i'll show you guys i'm just i'm shopping a lot but like i actually just wanted to make this i saw one guy posted something about overconsumption uh on her instagram and i feel like i also feel like that is such an important message 
don't get fooled not fooled really but like don't get into the overconsumption of us influencers or content creators uh because guys this is literally our job and most of the time we get stuff for free and some of us are trying to basically like invest in our businesses which is content creation so don't get fooled or get don't get caught up into in the overconsumption of us you don't have to buy clothes every week um i mean if you want to yes and if you can yes but don't get yourself into debt or feel pressure to buy clothes every week uh, i'm just here showing you outfit inf inspirations and things that i think are you know like key to styling your wardrobe and all of that like i'm just rambling i feel like i've been talking so much today but don't get lost in the overconsumption. don't don't do it so but if you feel like there's something that you're seeing from me and you maybe want to buy it like that's also good like it's like watching tv guys and seeing like your favorite actor or reality show star wearing something you don't have to have as many things as she has just get inspo and go buy what you can does that make sense hope that makes sense but let me sort out my hair situation and then i uh, will go downstairs to cook you know my husband is here when i'm eating this couscous salad i'm not even hungry honestly i'm just gachana. so i'll see you guys t oh that's disgusting i'll see you guys tomorrow let me go and go. My lovely friends of the internet <laughs> <coughs> I'm recovering from this flu that I know who exactly I got it from uh, I feel like I've also been such a bad vlogger like oh my god I've been so bad I don't even know what's going on in my vlog Jay, Ginji, I don't even know. But I'm getting ready to go to an event, guys. I am going to the clicks event. And later on, I'm going on a date with my hubby. I'm just trying to put on a wig, actually. I wanted to show you. I got these, guys. Because I don't know if I shared... I had this big take-a-lot order where I ordered a lot of things. Um... And I bought wig caps from Take A Lot, guys. When I tell you they are the worst, the thickest, the thickest wig caps I've ever seen in my life. I don't know if you can see, but these wig caps, like these stockings, are not thick. I don't know how to explain it, but the ones from Take A Lot, oh my word. You, you can see them through my wig. So I don't know how is that conducive, honestly, for trying to imitate the scalp like it all makes sense but anyway i also want to show you yesterday i went to planet nails and i wanted to do my nails today but i didn't because sana time is not it's on it's not on my side time it's up time it's up and i actually do not have time i need to be there at i need to be leaving in 20 minutes i don't know how that's gonna happen but anyway i wanted to do my nails and i got these these are apparently soaking off or soak off um nay uh, what do you call it foils that are already that already have um acetone in them that this is gonna save me and help me so much because soaking off is literally the bane of my existence i don't want to lie um and i always I, I never soak off i always just like buff at the top and then reapply so i feel like yeah no i need to sew off at this time at this point and i also got this was my best 
purchase or best find gold tubs. I don't know if you guys know, but I love gold tubs and I was DIYing them before and they would never last, but I feel like this is going to save me a lot of time and they're perfect. I'm so happy. Also like summer is coming and I'm going to be rocking those gold tips. I also got a milky white, a top coat and a milky white. Yeah, that's a top coat. And this is a milky white. Uh, because guys, I saw Sinovuyo guys. She had her nails like in a white base and a like that shiny chrome thingy. And Sana, I got the chrome pigment. And I said, I'm going to do that because her nails look stunning. But also, I'm just into the white, the, 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 the white, or it's called cotton in this brand. Uh, I'm in love with it. Like, I've seen girls rocking it, and I'm just like, that's, that's what I'm going to be doing. I also got some files and a brush. That's all. But anyway, I just also want to buy a new, like, clear plastic container for my nail stuff because a mess and it's not a mess because i'm untidy but it's a mess because that box is a mess in general and i've had that box for over like 10 years so i need to let it go let it go i need to do that for myself but um i'm about to watch a video on how to make your lace wig look good but anyway guys i've been speaking for five minutes i hope you guys are good i'll probably see you when i'm getting my outfit ready because i don't even know what to wear guys because believe it or not i literally just got off off the phone with google and i asked like i was just like oh is it cold and then she was just checking up on me and i'm like what are you wearing because i don't know i've never been to this event Bali has been to the event but she was just like wear flats and when google described her outfit i was like i was gonna wear that outfit because i saw her the other time she was wearing that outfit and i was like oh that would be the perfect outfit and i also got a denim skirt from cotton on and i was like oh good shot i'm gonna wear that outfit sana she's wearing that outfit so now i have to rethink so while i'm doing my wig i'm gonna be using this time to think to put on my outfit uh what outfit i'm gonna put on but also my skin update on my skin um the rash is gone but the dead skin skin is still there but i'm gonna show you the stuff that i got to remove this pigmentation um maybe tomorrow or in my next vlog because today has to be the end of the vlog but anyway guys let me This is so much better than those wig caps I got. I mean, I'm not a professional when it comes to putting on a wig, but I'm trying my best. Dead player, guys. Like, I'm honestly just trying my best because I'm trying to protect my hair. <laughs> oh, that hurts. I'm trying to protect my hair uh until i can relax it and i feel like i've stretched out my relaxer long enough Guys, with all the little experience I have when it comes to laying a wig. Oh, this wig is horrible to lay, guys. Oh my God, this wig. Oh no, it takes me a good two hours just to even get it looking like this. Like, oh, I fight for my life. I literally fight for my life to get this wig just to stick on my head. I love this wig with all my heart and this is literally like my wig like this is my wig if that makes sense like I'll wear this till it can't breathe anymore but putting it on honey 
it is a big fight. I literally fight for my life to put on this wig. I've been fighting this for the longest time. I wish I know where the answer to stop this is because you're Giagoa, Giagoa regarding this. But anyway, guys, let me do my makeup quickly so that I can at least be there for an hour. I also wanted to show you this beauty blender I got from Real Techniques. It's like, it's fairy. I don't know why. I'm choosing today to try it out because I don't have the time to play around but I'm gonna try it out and I'll tell you guys how I feel about it I think I need to charge my camera before I leave I honestly feel like I fought for my life to get this almost very mediocre install like it's nice but like for two hours son more than two hours it needs to look like it's coming out from my scalp because while this wig Ow. This work is honestly joy mojito. <laughs> ah, music honestly like that sounds like I'm that person who says mojito. But anyway, not to say that there's something wrong. But anyway, yeah, and you go basically. That's what I'm trying to say. Also, I'm wearing my uniform. I have to go find my lip liner. But anyway, I'm gonna eat KFC on my way there. So I'll do my lips when I get to the car. Um, hubby, what's going on? This wig, guys. This wig is. Like, if I don't have my hair short, I'm wearing this wig. Nothing. The rest is... The rest is occasion. It's because maybe I want to, long, I want to wear long hair. But... This wig and short hair. That's what I'm gonna wear from now on. I'm in my Anna Winter era. And I'm gonna be here for a very long time. It's giving... I'm going to scam rich businessmen for money. Because I have some conspiracy... Uh, business idea that's gonna save the world because these cargoes when that guy was altering my cargoes he said mama I'm giving you non-existent waste and that's what you're gonna serve let me show you I think I'm gonna take my hound's tooth um, blazer though I wanted to wear a skirt but I changed my mind I'm wearing a turtleneck uh, my cargoes and my sambas. I don't know if I should keep the sambas like I don't love them But like I'm going to a place where I'm gonna be walking around. So wearing anything else besides these is Honestly torture. I think I'm gonna take my hound's tooth blazer Maybe I can wear these boots yes, instead of this ne? Because I feel like the sambas make me look weird. Guys, I'm literally walking for my life. I feel like I have been walking. <laughs> oh, I can see the event. Let me quickly go, guys. I've been delayed, see, like. <laughs> but Kim just got here, so I'm also not stressed. I wonder if Gugu's here. <laughs>
Guys, I have never received so many products in my life. Like this bag, I literally needed my husband to come help me with this bag. And I also have more products in here. You know what? If this event ever happens again, please buy the ticket. Like buy the ticket and go. It it's worth it. I just want to end the vlog because, believe it or not, this has to go up tomorrow. And I haven't started editing. I don't even know. I just want to show you. I got this from Nivea. Guys, I don't, I don't even think I can go through all of these. I'm excited for this. I want to try this under eye cream from Ole. I've been looking for vitamin C under eye. And I also got this. Kim was like, get this baby. I, I didn't buy any of this thing, guys. It's literally like stuff that I had to play games for or brands would like just give. This is the L'Oreal Elviv. And one thing about Kim, anything she says goes for me, especially when it comes to hair. And then they also got us this. This apparently won something. It has rosemary. And I hope it helps and saves my hair because my hair is going down. And then this I'm also excited for because this is the glycolic acid serum that was launching yesterday in Joburg. I am so excited. Want to try it. Guys, do you really want to see all of this? Also, Dove gave us everything, hey? Dove gave us everything that they sell. Like, literally, like, Kwasa shampoo, conditioner. I used to use this, actually, back in the days. Crazy, crazy business. Um, Body Love. I actually love Dove. Oh, I use this. I use this. And I also have a men's one. Maybe I should give it to my husband. It's like a cute travel size. Oh my god, I used to use this mask. Oh, I used to use this mask, guys. Crazy business. I used to use this mask in high school. And they also have this shower gel. Sana, I'm going to be saving on toiletries at this month. There's a lot of saving that's going to be taking place. And I just want to see. Oh my god. Was a kind of god, guys. Hey, Clicks said you're gonna have everything. I want to see what's interesting in here. I got little La Roche posay samples. Where am I gonna pack all of this? <laughs> Panty liners from kind of god. Let me see. Oh, what's this? Shower gel. From the body shop. I'm literally just grabbing. <laughs> oh my god. I got samples from Sarah V. Uh Uningi Apa guys. Wow. This is a leave-in curl milk. Kori Hutetsi. Oh, I use, I have this. I use this. Let me see how small the sample is. What is this for? Oh, this is a spot corrector. You know what I mean? Spot, eh? What do you do with this? Well, Wow, I need to try this. And even tone spot corrector. Sun. Mm, so happy. Guys, I actually buy and use the serum. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy that I don't have to buy the serum this month. Oh, I am so happy. Guys, if I, as I'm saying, if you 
if this event ever happens again, buy your tickets. I'm trying my best to get stuff that <laughs> so many things guys there's no way I'm not gonna have battery space I'm just trying to get stuff what's this oh this is a little collagen drink oh guys Hey. Native child. I've actually never used their stuff. Sana. Oh, my hair's going to be so happy. <laughs> There's no way I'm going to finish this, guys. Oh, this is nice. Cetaphil brightening. Sana. Oh, Sana, so many free things. Kuningi, guys, Kuningi. But anyway, also just wanted to show you. Oh my god, I saw Kim wearing these socks. And I've been looking for these cute socks to wear my sambas with my dress, my skirts and my dresses with. And I found them. Super, super cute. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining me in this chaotic vlog. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Um,. I'll see you guys. I'm going to start my new vlog tomorrow. Love you guys. And I highly, highly appreciate you.